what's up guys this is shambles 11 and welcome to bridge constructor portal published by head up games and developed by clockstone studio this is bridge constructor with an officially licensed portal theme uh, we even have ellen mclean the original voice of glados back and she will act as our tutorial through the many different levels 60 of which we have to get our way through uh, set uh, in the Aperture Science Enrichment Centre. Um, it's, it's bridge constructor with portal theme. Um, Humour is all there, the sounds are there, and, and all the environments that you'd expect to find. Um, plus we'll be using things like portals, aerial faith plates, propulsion gel, repulsion gel, um, and we'll be evading sentry turrets, emancipation grills, laser fields, acid vats, it's all here, um, it's all licensed and it's all pretty cool. Essentially what we do is we have to get these little fellas across the bendies uh, on their little, I think they're little trucks, uh, from one side to the other. Uh, and it starts off nice and simple, it is just build a bridge and you can copy exactly what you're told to. And then we end up doing some pretty cool and funky crisscrossy things. Um, to complete the levels you just have to get one forklift truck across. Um, to, to really go that extra mile you have to do a convoy which is what you're seeing right now. Uh, and of course all of these add up to achievements. There are a few achievements, there's not that many, there's 19 in total. Uh, but after about 2-3 hours of gameplay I'm on just over 500G, so there is some decent achievements to be got fairly quickly. And if you're stuck or just want to blast through achievements super quick, because this game has been out on Steam for quite a while, there are full guides available for practically every level, so there's no reason to get stuck. On top of that there's a, a pretty cool little guide you might have to open the door rather than smash into that. Uh, there is a, a great little guide uh, teaching you the basics uh, of how to build bridges uh, that is available at any time. And actually, it's very helpful stuff. You might want to check that out. Uh, 60 levels, like I said, in total. And they do ramp up in difficulty. I would say the first dozen or so I got through without really thinking about and then there were a couple of levels that started and I thought I really genuinely don't have a clue what to do here. I've got no idea how we're going to make this work uh, and it's quite rewarding not using those guides and actually figuring it out and thinking about things because when it works it really is quite satisfying. Um, as you can see some of these require quite a bit of trial and error and you will make plenty of errors which is fine because again it all adds up to achievements um, there are also achievements as well as just completing levels there are ones for killing yourself a certain number of times or, or should I say the bendies um, there's also ones for going through portals a certain number of times making loop portals all that kind of thing uh, the humor is absolutely here uh, you start off the game as a new employee to the aperture science building and you have to go for a job interview. Uh, if you don't ask, uh, sorry, answer any of the questions asked in a way that they like, well, it's a pretty painful ending, shall we say. Uh, so far, I have thoroughly enjoyed this. Uh, while it could potentially get frustrating, uh, it, to get them right is just so rewarding, you don't mind the trial and error. Um, there have been a couple of times where I've just sat here and thought, I really have no idea how to make this any better, but generally just a little bit of tweaking can make an absolutely huge difference um, the graphics are nice the sounds are, are perfectly fine they're there the music isn't isn't too obtrusive it, it nicely ticks along in the background um, overall if you have played a portal game or a bridge constructor game you know what you're going to get um, and you won't be disappointed. Uh, I've actually preferred this much, much more to the standard bridge constructor. Uh, I found it just a bit more charming, and uh, I, I like how different each level is, rather than just you know a different different angle gap to get through. There are actually you know proper things to think about. Um, I, I personally would would definitely give this a go. Uh, I thoroughly enjoyed it. It's quite simple. There's only two items we need: scaffolding and ropes. From that. Anything is possible with all these portals. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Till next time. Bye.